Ladies and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today is June 22nd and we are going to be looking into the dark truth. Anything that wants to come in that we can kind of try to figure out that can make things easier on your journey. Leo, you're making plans. You're making plans. In your past, you're, you're coming up as a woman who was very, is, you know, is very passionate, loving. This is also family. <clears throat> there was an ending in your life, though. There was something that came to an end. This was a lover's connection that came to an end. These universal energies. Ooh. Spirit guides and ancestors, please give me one. Okay. Ooh. All right. I am going to take that. That fell on the floor. Okay. Excuse the noise. <laughs> Excuse the noise. I don't have, I don't edit these videos. I put 12 videos out a day. Um, four of pentacles. These are the extra cards that fell out. So I'm just going to show you all of them. Um, and then we're going to clarify. Okay. You start off the reading with the two of wands. It looks like you are making plans on something. It looks like you are, you know, stepping into your own mental energy and trying to put a plan together. This is the queen of wands. This is a woman who is loving. She is caring. She is also very passionate, you know, very seductive, seductress. You also have the 10 of swords. Something in your life came to an end. There was a uh, something that just died. You know, this could be, you know, Everybody's in a different timeline. So if you're like, this is not me. Okay, well, it could be you three months from now. We don't know. It could have been you five years ago. Um, this is the lovers. This was a bond that you had with a certain somebody. Or it is something that you are currently looking for and wishing on your desires. Something that, you you know, some of you may even be afraid to be in a relationship. You have the six of wands here. Some of you are rising up. Whoever was stuck in a bad place, you're rising up. You're getting out of there and you are leaving something behind. You know, you're rising up. You're elevating to a different level. You also have here the nine of cups. Listen, wishes are coming in for some of you. For some of you who have done the work, wishes are coming in. Wishes are being granted. For those of you who are... Not in negative energies, you know, because this is a lot of melodrama. This is a lot of drama. Something came to an end and it was very dramatic. You know, it was like, you know, this is also being backstabbed. This is also being betrayed, you know, this was an ending. You also have the priestess. This is a woman who is quiet. She is a woman who is very intuitive she knows what, what she knows everything that's going on. She writes it in this little book and guess what? She remembers it, but she's quiet. She sees everything. Even her book has eyeballs. Look, it's got one eye right there. This is somebody who is, you know, who has secrets. This is somebody who knows a lot of different things and is just not speaking. You also have the seven of wands. Listen, some of you are in a situation where you're standing strong on that. You are standing strong and you're waiting for this to change. And you are not moving from this situation until it does. Some of you are leaving. I see some of you taking a trip. You know, this is you hoping or fearing that you might not be able to take that trip. It is the chariot, so it's a leaving. However, it's where the card falls as well. You also have here the five of cups. 
So with the five of cups, I feel that you are in a situation where you are feeling a little sad. You're feeling a little heavy. You're going through some grief. This is you in the future going through some grief over something, you know? If you hear construction, it's kind of just shuffling my mind. Just discard it. Somebody's out there building a house. Um, you also have here the four pentacles. This is looking for stability. This is being in your comfort zone. This is holding on to your money. Listen, some of you have the king of pentacles. This could be a person. You know, I don't know why this came up as a bonus. Some of you are or or will be dealing with a person who is a demonic energy. This is a person who comes in and they blindside you for some reason. You know, this could also be you fighting your inner demon, trying to let it not run your life. We all have an inner demon in our bodies. We just don't know it. You know, even the kindest person, believe me. They have a demon inside them. You also have the King of Pentacles. It looks like you're going to be coming into, into a union with someone who is prosperous. Someone who's got money. This is somebody who is stable. This is somebody who's a little older. He is loving and caring. However, he does think a lot about his moolah, his cash. We're going to clarify why, okay, why is the two of wands here? Why is the two of wands here for Leo? What are you planning, Leo? Leo, you want your wishes to come true. You're looking for stability. You're looking for balance in your life. You want to be the 10. You're having money struggles. Some of you are having money struggles. You feel like you are being left out in the cold. However, this is going to lead you to a new place for some of you who are going to do the work of, you know, money struggles and everything. I see you prospering. You're going to be loving. You're going to be caring. You're not going to feel like you're so out in the fucking cold. This is wishes coming true. This is finding your balance. This is something leaving you in a bad place. And now you're trying to find, you know, some recovery, making things even. Why is the chariot here? Ten of Pentacles. Listen, for those of you who left, this equation, wherever you were, this lover's situation that came to an end, you good things are coming to you. This is you having the fullest life, the fullest abundance. It is being loaded. It is working hard for all your money. This is having the family, the friends, the pets, the house. This is having everything in life. I'm going to take this out because it was sticking out like this. Some of you have made a decision. Some of you are a woman. I see two women here. Some of you, one of you is loving and however the other one, you know, this could be the same thing. You could be the same woman. You know, you, every person has two sides. This is a woman who makes a decision and she will fucking make herself be heard. Why is the five of cups here? You're dealing with someone young. And this someone young has somebody else young. I'm going to show you. This. This knight of swords. Either you were clear with him or he was clear with someone. However, there is a page here. A page. A page of wands. This is someone who's young, who wants to bring in good news, who is being optimistic. These are two young people. Whether they were part of the mix, it looks like you made a decision about these two people. You know, and this person was fucking honest. They said something to you and you were like, don't fucking come to me and tell me shit. You know? It's only what I'm picking up. Why is the devil here? Why is the devil here? Oof, it's a lot, but we'll take him. 
There was lies and deceptions here. And look at this. You get one more time. This is lies and deception. Whatever you left behind, do not feel bad. This was all filled with lies and bullshit and drama and secrets. Who wants to be a part of that? You also get the five of cups again. So you have the five of cups twice. The only way that you're going to get your ten of cups is by leaving this equation. It is by leaving all this negative energy behind. You also have the lovers. So the lovers, again, you have it twice. You have it twice. These are two different decks. You have it twice. Why do you have it twice? Because that's something that you're manifesting. Oh my God, there's another person here. This is, this is another page of pentacles. Wow. So you got, you got two pages. Listen, there's young people here. This could also be two kids. You know, it could be that somebody, you know, one of your kids, you know, is successful in money. It could be a new beginning in money. You know, it could be a few different things. Why is the high priestess here? Why is the high priestess here? Another queen of wands. Listen, there was another woman in this mix, okay? And I don't, I believe that this woman has been left out in the cold, you know? However, you have made decisions about this situation, and in, and you you're starting to realize that in order for you to get all the abundance that the universe is willing to give you is by removing yourself from all these people. There is a ton of people here and they're all young energy. You know, they're very reckless. I only see here, you know, like one king and I see him in your future. And then I just see the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Swords. So you could be the same person simply because you could be a, the person that's looking at things for what they are. However, you are in a place where you are, you know, whether you were left out in the cold before, it doesn't matter. You've elevated from that. You know, you've elevated and you are on your way. I do see you moving away from this. Um... You know, the only closest thing that came to my mind was the four. It could be four weeks, four months, you know. It's only, like I said, what I'm picking up. You have also the nine here, the nine of cups, because you have this twice. Those are wishes being granted. Listen, wishes can come true when you remove yourself from this negative energy. Some of you have, have already left, and congratulations. Listen, I hope that this was able to bring you some kind of clarity, and have a great day.